I'd like to point a few things out to begin this video. In my three plus years doing Thor news, I think I've done over a hundred videos on the sun and its daily stellar evolution. You change every day, so does the sun. Two, I covered the weather a lot and then I stopped covering it for a while. So when I started talking about it, I said the storm could be bad. And three, while the American mainstream media is unified in their intentions to get you whacking your mental pud over Donald freaking Trump, I'm over here saying, hey, I need you to stay alert, stay aware, be awake, because these are the days where you put your big girl panties on, you put your big boy boots on, and we begin to act like the 700th generation. There is some weird shit going on with the sun. There is some weird shit going on with the weather. There is some weird shit going on with politics. And there is some weird shit going on with just about everything else. But if you would like to understand something, it's best to understand it top down. And at the moment, other than God, I know nothing in our solar system higher than the sun. And so these are strange times. Indeed. Strange days indeed, my friends. I just want to say, so hey, keep your eye on the sun. Because when it freaks out, you're going to feel some emotional turbulence. And so will everybody else. And keep your eye on the weather. Because when cars start floating and trees start falling, it's best we as a people start recognizing patterns and figure out how to adapt and deal with them. I have not given up on the future of us, our country, our world, and our planet. And I pray you haven't either. So I just want to reiterate again, but not too clearly, the weather is very weird. So please take all weather warnings and watches seriously if they come to your area. Because we have seen far too many cities and towns underwater in the last decade. And that number seems to keep rising. So I'm not here to debate the causes and the validity of climate change, carbon taxes. I'm just here to say, we should probably be ready for anything. And as Americans, I don't think worrying about Donald Trump too much. It's going to do a whole heck of a lot of good. But I don't want to get into votes, electoral college, banks, currency, money, defense contractors, and old pirates from outer space. Anywho, so it's uh, flooding bad in Texas, flooding bad in Louisiana, and the giant angry bacon strip of stormy weather is making its way across America again. We need to keep an eye on river levels. They can't just keep rising, rising, because if they do, that's nothing but trouble. So I thought I would put that out there for those who listen and understand, because we are all in this together, people, this giant solar system party. Y'all need to calm the fuck down. Stop being so angry. Stop being so proud. And stop acting like you know everything. Oh, let's all try to be better drivers if we can. Sorry, the sun's freaking out, so now I'm in a mood. And I shared it with you. God bless everyone. Peace out. The weather's bad, and it's getting worse. There is my spring forecast. We need to keep an eye on river levels. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to point a few things out to begin this video. In my three plus years doing Thor news, I think I've done over a hundred videos on the sun and its daily stellar evolution. You change every day, so does the sun. Two, I covered the weather a lot and then I stopped covering it for a while. So when I started talking about it, I said the storm could be bad. And three, while the American mainstream media is 